Next up to this stage, Speakbit, our founder, Moon Ma, and Garrett Agresta. And a special thanks to their lead mentor, Casey Self. Moon, I'm honored to welcome you to the stage. Everyone has been silenced in the past. You probably can recall once, twice, or 10 times. For non-native speakers, it's years. I'm Moon, the co-founder of SpeakBeat. We use AI to improve communication confidence for non-native speakers. Seven years ago, I came to US for the life I dreamed of. What I ended up having was two years of isolation and a completely changed personality because of my English. Communication is our entrance to the world. In all the elements that make up communication, our accent is the fastest way that others can decide who you are and where you are from. It took me five years, a major depression, and a godsend husband to get comfortable in my own accent. I don't want to say that happened to anyone else in these 49 million non-native speakers in the US. I want everyone feel comfortable in their own voice, no matter the language they speak. Two years ago, the language learning market was $60 billion. And this number will continue to grow to $190 billion in five years. Right now in the US, one in five households do not speak English at home. After I spent a month and thousand dollars trying all the solutions in the market to improve my speech training and finding none worked, I built a SpeakBeat. SpeakBeat uses AI to improve communication confidence for non-native speakers. It puts personal speech into your pocket. As a machine learning engineer at Amazon, I recognize that the accent training process can be done much faster using machine learning. <laughs> Instead of taking hours like out of your already busy life, SpeakBeat captures your natural speech using a wireless mic ear cuff that runs in the background throughout the day. It gives you personalized feedback on the exact mistake you just had. This means you can see the improvement in minutes rather than days. The magic of SpeakBeat is it's no, it knows what is, the most in, what is the most impactful improvement you can make. For the current options in the market to get the personalized feedback, you need to spend $100 per hour hiring someone to train you. Think about that. It's $100 per hour and people are still doing it. With $100, SpeakBeat put a whole year of personalized speech training into your pocket. So why not? As ChatGPT entered the view of general public, the, infl the inflection point of AI is happening right now. The capability and the cost of AI just made this possible last year. Currently, we have already built the prototype. We plan to do beta testing with the international students over the summer. In the fall, we'll finalize the mobile app, build the community piece, and develop our marketing strategy. We plan to launch at the end of this year. After launch, we'll first target professionals who already spent $1,000 in their speech training as our early adopters, and we plan on a monthly subscription of $10. As we build our use base in the next two years, we'll begin to market our enterprise subscriptions to organizations that hire international employees. At the moment, we have two employees, myself and my husband, and we are both machine learning engineers. As we get to the enterprise subscriptions, we'll hire a salesperson. I'm asking for $10,000 today to get our first 200 users. 
This $10,000 will be used to speed up our learning process. I will cover the, it will cover the technical and freelancing costs in our beta testing and community building. I wouldn't be here, I wouldn't be able to hear to speak seven years ago. And I want everyone present themselves comfortably in meetings, job interviews, and the social setting. And SpeakBeat can make this happen. I'm Moon, the co-founder of SpeakBeat. Great job. Thank you. Um, it's obviously a very uh, passion project for you, and I appreciate that, and you did a fantastic job. Um, you mentioned that the SpeakBit runs in the background all day. What kind of impact does that have on battery life and performance of the devices that it runs on? So currently we tested, uh, that's a good question. I actually didn't pay attention to the battery, uh, but we tested four hours, like the phone didn't die. Um, the performance of the phone? Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I need to look into that. And my second question is, uh, you mentioned $10 a month, so $120 a year uh, in revenue for usage. What's your expected lifetime value of the customer? Like, do I only need to use this for three months and then I'm great? Or do I need to keep using this for three years? So that is a subjective, like that's a decision the user themselves. It's make, the, the goal is to make them comfortable, confident in their communication. And we want to have a holistic solution for this. And Accent is a like, shortcut to that. But in the end, even native speakers here, when you're a southerner, you go to California, you don't feel comfortable with your accent, then there's always things you want to work on. Walk me through going after uh, your customers. So uh, so, in, uh, so it works with a, a wireless ear cup, it's sort of like a earring. So in the morning you will wear it and it lasts uh, 16 hours. Uh, it will track the audio in the background and uh, uh, depends on your advancement level, it will have like sensitivity, how frequency, how frequent the feedback to give you, sorry. So whenever you speak, it, tra it transcribe what your audio into the text and on the sentence, it will have a word level and a phoneme level feedback on your accent. And you can type, it's color coded, so you can type it and practice until you feel comfortable with it. Another question. So I want to learn Spanish. I'm going to go look after, look out and download, you know, apps, et cetera. So your customer on the other side, who is actually, I mean, I, I get it that it's a non-native speaker, but is the non-native speaker conscious that this would be out there? And are there any competitors similar? So are you asking how we're going to market this to reach our, yeah, so, uh, or competitor, which one first? L little both. Okay, uh, I'll answer the competitor first. So the closest two competitors in the market, one is called Bold Voice, backed by YC, and the second one is called Chatter Fox. Uh, so the Bold Voice, they do not, like you have to sit there, I, I, I registered, like that's what I tried first, and uh, I, I need to spend another hour through the day to follow the fix, the training. It's a burden, like you are busy, you don't want it to get in your way. Uh, and the chatterbox is uh, like a, a, a semi-automated way to, it basically requires the tutor and the trainer on the other side, and it's way more expensive. Oh, sorry, what's your second question? Marketing. Oh, do I still have time? <laughs> Okay, sorry. <laughs> <laughs>